ExxonMobil is looking to lower its emissions at its Baytown complex. Honeywell recently announced that one of its carbon capture technologies will be deployed by ExxonMobil and integrated into Exxon's low-carbon hydrogen production facility in Baytown, Texas. The technology is expected to enable the capture of approximately 7 million tons of CO2 annually. It is anticipated that Honeywell's CO2 fractionation and hydrogen purification system, the name of the company's carbon capture technology, will enable ExxonMobil to capture about 7 million tons of carbon dioxide each year. This amount of emissions is equivalent to the yearly emissions produced by 1.5 million automobiles. More specifically, the carbon capture technology that will be integrated into ExxonMobil's low-carbon hydrogen production facility will allow the facility to capture over 98% of associated CO2 emissions. The CO2 that is captured is expected to be sequestered and stored permanently by ExxonMobil. ExxonMobil's low-carbon hydrogen facility in Baytown will become the largest in the world. It is expected that the oil and gas giants Baytown Low Carbon Hydrogen, Ammonia and Carbon Capture Facility will generate about 1 billion cubic feet of low carbon H2 per day, making it the world's largest low carbon hydrogen project at planned startup in 2027 to 2028. The use of Honeywell's technology enables ExxonMobil to reduce CO2 emissions at a large scale. Already now, carbon capture technology works to decarbonize production processes and is effective because it can allow for significant emissions reduction that can play a major role in the energy transition, said Barry Glickman, Vice President and General Manager, Honeywell Sustainable Technology Solutions, in a company news release. Honeywell has over 50 years of experience in gas processing and extensive experience with proven carbon capture and H2 technologies. The company's advanced solvent carbon capture and hydrogen solutions make it possible to capture, transport, and store carbon dioxide at a reduced cost via greater efficiency while enabling smaller equipment and lower capital operation expenses that are required to operate the plant compared to current tech. At present, 15 million tons of CO2 is being captured and used in storage and or utilization applications through Honeywell's technologies each year. Existing Honeywell customers have the capability of capturing 40 million tons of CO2 annually via installed projects across the globe using Honeywell's CO2 tech. As for ExxonMobil, the company feels that their investment in Honeywell's carbon capture technology shows their commitment to lowering emission at their own operations and supporting their customers in their efforts to decarbonize. The scale of this project is expected to enable up to 30% of scope 1 and 2 emissions from our Baytown facility by switching from natural gas as a fuel source to low-carbon hydrogen, said Dan Amon, president of ExxonMobil Low Carbon Solutions. This is Jake Martin. Don't miss out. Hit subscribe and check out our newly updated ebook on the link below. Leave us a comment and let us know what you think. Thank you.